Hi guys, what I've done here is I have set up a circuit to demonstrate that a filament bulb is not an ohmic device. It does not obey Ohm's law. Now what I've got, I've got my power supply here and the power supply has also got a variable resistor inside it. So I'm going to vary the current and the voltage across the bulb here. Now, what I've also got in in uh, series with the bulb is an ammeter here to measure the current and I've also set, uh, set up a voltmeter here so we can measure the voltage as well. Now what I'm going to do is to begin with I'm only going to increase the voltage probably maybe up to one volt or maybe two volts. Now what you're going to see is the current and if you're looking on the scales I'm looking on the the top scale of the ammeter from one to five amps and for the voltmeter, it's the middle scale uh, for, the, uh, for the voltage from um, 0 to 15 volts. But we're really going to go up to probably around um, uh, just, just a few volts and we'll see what happens. Okay, so here we go. So to begin with, maybe let's just go up to maybe, uh, if it's even increasing, yeah, it's slowly increasing. In fact, you can see the voltmeter is hardly going up at all. My current is over one amp already, hardly anything changing on the voltmeter at all. What you might notice is the, the, the bulb here is going to start to glow. And as it glows, what happens is the resistance of the bulb actually increases. It might take a little bit more current just to get to that point. Okay, now uh, we're actually only over up to half a volt here. And with half a volt, we've got over two amps. If I increase up to one volt now, okay, now you can see the bulb is starting to glow. And in fact, I'm not even touching anything, but you can see as it glowed, the, the current actually went down slightly as the resistance of the bulb actually increased. It's stabilized now. Okay, if we go up to one and a half volts, uh, well now uh, we're, we're, the current is still increasing, but not that much. Now it's just almost uh, about 2.8, uh, two volts. Well, again, not much of an increase. Uh, one point. Uh, sorry, this is two point five volts now. Again, a bit of an increase again, but not not a huge increase. Uh, let's maybe go. This is three volts now. The bulb's getting pretty bright, but the change in current isn't that much at all. So, if you look at the graph here, let me turn this off again. Okay, so what, what's really happening here is for a, a small change in voltage, we get a very, very large amount of current. But as we increase, so say if we went from maybe 5 volts to 7 volts, the change would be almost nothing at all. That's because the resistance of the bulb has increased because the heat from the bulb causes the atoms inside the filament to vibrate more and they get in the way of the electrons as they're trying to flow through the, through the filament and then that's because the resistance has increased. Okay guys, hope that helps. Bye for now.